Brixham Theatre. I don't know why I am here. My friends just dragged me in. Um, but yes, I'm on the stage. Look, you can see the auditorium. And there's nobody else here, which is very strange. I actually thought he was trying bringing me here to kill me. Um, anyway, guys, uh, we are in Brixham today because I am going to see uh, an old friend. So we're going to grab a coffee and I thought I would just kind of do a little bit of a vlog for you. Um, just so you can kind of see Brixham because I know so many of you don't live here. So thought you might find it interesting. Anyway, guys, um, I probably won't do a lot of talking in the vlog because, you know, it always looks a bit weird when you're talking to the camera on your own. And I thought I'd take this opportunity, since we're in an abandoned theatre, uh, to talk to you. And I'm actually on the stage right now, so yay. Um, anyway, guys, um, I hope you enjoy this vlog and I will speak to you in a bit. So, so I've just been in uh, Holland and Barrett and uh, picked up some snail gel stuff. So uh, that's coming up soon. Things that they put all the fish in. Lobster pots. Lobster pots. They put lobsters in them. Or no. lobsters get in them. Yes. They put bait in them and the lobsters come in. What do they use for bait? Fish. Oh. So they do put fish in them. Yeah. Oh. Maybe. I'm not quite sure. No. I'm, I'm not um I'm not an expert. All I can say is it smells pretty fishy. Well they they come out on the every something you don't get to see every day a load of lobster pots the joys of living in a fishing village I guess port port a fishing port mm. English England's oldest England's oldest fishing port mm. Everybody. so I've just got home it's actually a little bit later than what I planned because um, I went back to my friend Jamie's house and we um, just started yabbing and chatting as you do um, but yeah I just th thought I would say like I hope you really enjoyed those little snippets of Brixham For those of you that don't know I don't know if I said this before Brixham is like in Devon which is where I live um, but I don't live in you know Brixham which is why I shared it and the reason we were in a theatre, not sure I mentioned this either, is that my friend Jamie um, works in the theatre. Um, he just never had taken me inside before. Um, but yeah, it was a really, really lovely day. I got to catch up with a really old, lovely friend. Not that she's old, but she's an old, old friend. Like, I hadn't seen her for about, probably about 12 years. Um, which just is the longest time ever. Um, and you 
as a person like you know your life kind of changes and you just move with it and you don't really necessarily think back about like how things were before and then when you meet somebody that you had like an amazing friendship with before and you see how they've grown as a person and all the amazing things that they are doing now not that they were doing horrible things before or, or you know just like different things um but yeah when you see how people have changed and like are doing really really well and it's just really nice to just kind of catch up and like reminisce and at the same time you know think about the future um and what that could look like and stuff so yeah it was just a lovely lovely afternoon and i drank far too much coffee which is why a i can't speak this evening and b i'm buzzing like a b um i've just put all my sainsbury shopping away i need to upload a video i've got dinner on so it's very organized even though I'm running a few hours behind where I thought I would be. Um, so guys, that's it for this little vlog. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day um, and I will catch you all later.